Hi, beautiful. It's Tin Tuesday. My name's Powder. I am not allowed on the internet, and I'm also the best booster machine. And today is Tin Tuesday on the day of Tin Tuesday, which is a Tuesday. Like every week has a Tuesday, right? Every week has a Tuesday, it goes Monday, Tuesday, and then Wednesday. So on Tuesday, we open a tin. And today is that day. Okay, cool. Let's uh transition. How was that? That was a transition, my friends. Okay, so we're gonna be uh finishing up this line of tins. We've opened up Grookey, we've opened up Sobble, and now we have a score bunny tin with the Cinderace V right there. Of course, we got our giveaway from last week as well. We're gonna be opening this bay bay. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I didn't actually throw the tin on the ground. That would have been great. That would have been great for content, but I can't do it. Okay, so open up the tin lid. Open up the tin lid. You take the tin lid and you throw it. Last week we opened this tin up and there were some crazy, crazy cards in it. But check this out, Cinderace V. Put that on the side. Uh, there were some crazy packs in it too. So this week we got Sword and Shield, Sword and Shield, Unbroken Bonds, and Burning Shadows and Evolutions. Okay, so last week there was Cosmic Eclipse inside of it, but this week there's no Cosmic Eclipse. Okay, so. But we also have some Shining Legends and Hidden Fates, obviously chasing a Shining Rayquaza, a Shining Mew, or... Um, a shiny Charizard, which we don't have. So we're gonna be going after this. And um, yeah, there's a couple cards in here that we gotta start pulling and let's start pulling these babies. Let's start pulling. I gotta fix my, let's go, let's do this. Let's get some good, let's get some good pulls today. Code card for you, code card for me. There's a giant truck outside making noise. Ha <laughs> ha, wow, I love it. I don't. I don't love it. One, two, three, four. So, Sword and Shield has randomly become a pretty expensive uh, set. It went from being like $90 a booster box to like $150 a booster box. So, that's pretty cool that we're getting some Sword and Shield packs. Sobble in a Score Bunny tin. We got a Pharaoh Seed and a Sableye V to start off our day. I will take it! That's how we play this game. Because I'm the best booster machine, okay? Sableye V. I really like Sableye. It is a really, 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 really cool Pokemon. Um, but uh, I like the Mega for it. But um, I want to get some more. I wish we got some more Sableye cards. I think there is a, I think there is a Sableye full art. I don't know what set it is in. But it doesn't actually matter now, does it? Okay, so... Psychic Energy, Hitmon Lee, Rare Candy, Lucky. I have hair in my mouth. Ugh. 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 Wooloo, Shelder, Krogunk, Silicobra, Minchino, and a Choodle. Mor oh wait, did I mess that? Oh, more Peko. Okay, that's her. That's her. Okay. I forgot that Mor Morpico was, uh, you know, is considered the big boss man. So we got some Unbroken Bonds, Burning Shadows. Let's open up some Unbroken Bonds. Unbroken Bonds has a um, Charizard inside of it. Haven't pulled the Charizard. Would be amazing to pull said Charizard. Haven't done it in my life. But then again, I haven't really opened a, a bunch of Unbroken Bonds. It's, it's, it's a set that it's worth... Um, it was worth opening when the prices were low, but it's not really worth opening anymore. Like, some sets, it's just, you can't be opening, you can't be, you can't be putting your money into some sets to open. You know what I mean? Sandile, Genesect, Reverse Hollow, and a Dedenne GX! I will take it! Ha ha! I will woo! Thoughts? I feel like my mom, like my mom's downstairs and she like listens 
to me recording and just goes, what's wrong with this man? Why did, why is this my son? It's really sad. Now I think about it. We'll talk about evolutions in the second year, but Burning Shadows, we actually got a very go a good pull from Burning Shadows last week. I don't expect that type of luck again at all in any way possible at all, because that's, that's just how Burning Shadows works. You don't, dude, this is how bad the quality in Burning Shadows is. These two cards, this is the code card and it's stuck, it's stuck, it's stuck onto this card. That's how bad Burning Shadows is. It was literally, the code card was stuck. One, two, three, four, Burning Shadows, leaving me with a burning hole in my heart because that's just what it is. That's what it does, all right? Dark Energy, Lana, Electabuzz, Simipore, Duskull, Dynamo, Cutie Fly, Riolu. That is an awesome Riolu art. That is really, really cool Riolu art, personally. Rhyhorn. Rhydon and a Azumarill, dude. Azumarill Cha, bro. Yeah, dude. Uh -huh. Let's talk about evolutions for one second. Before I actually open this pack, I want to talk about evolutions. Evolutions prices have skyrocketed. Like, I'm talking about this went from being $400 a booster box a week and a half, two weeks ago from this video being uploaded to almost $700 a booster box now. Like that's the going price for this thing. That is crazy. I have a lot of booster boxes. I do, I do, I do, I do. All bought under $150. <laughs> oh my God, I'm amazing. But, um, Evolutions is very sought after, so I'm kind of surprised that we're seeing it in these tins. Honestly speaking, I was not expecting to be seeing Evolutions in these tins, so it's pretty it's pretty nice. For, um, for a set that costs as much as it does, to be getting it in a retail $25 tin, you know, and I screwed it up. I messed it up. That entire speech about evolutions that I just gave about how it's so important, I hyped it up, and then I screwed the pooch right now, guys. That's what I did. I screwed it. There was a pooch, and it got screwed. Because that's what I just, it's, it's a Mewtwo. We got a Mewtwo, and we got a maintenance. Reverse Hollow. Do I want a reverse Hollow maintenance? No, I wanted a Charizard. Did I get it? I probably would have gotten the Charizard if I didn't screw it up. I'm telling you guys right now. That's what I proclaim. My destiny was to get the Charizard if I didn't screw it up. But that's what you, that's what I get for opening a bunch of packs in a row that are, you know, Sword and Shield, four, four is the thing, and then I open Evolutions, and of course that's what happens. But that's my life. That's my life. All right, guys, so we're going to talk about who has won the giveaway. The giveaway. Freshiram. Freshiram. Uh, Rushram, amazing rare. We're gonna be we we're giving it away this week. Uh, so the winner from last week's answering the question of which which is better, Zekrom, Rushram. I don't know. I I flip flop back and forth of which one I think is better. But uh, the person that won this, um, Pearl Muffin. Congratulations, Pearl Muffin said, "Yo, uh, Zekrom is better, but I actually like Rushram too." And you know what? I get it. I understand. I feel the same. Way. I flip flop. Some days it's a Zekrom, some days it's a Rushiram. I don't know. I don't actually know how I feel myself. That's why I ask you guys in the comment sections. Okay? Subscribe, leave a like, comment. Ugh. This week's giveaway is um, the birds from the Full Art Birds, Moltres, Zapdos, and Articuno Tag Team. The reason I'm giving away this card is because I've pulled this card a bajillion times. A shabajillion times I've pulled it. All you gotta tell me is which one your favorite is. Zapdos, Moltres, Articuno. Put it in the comments section below. Share it with a friend. Pearl Muffin, please do contact me via Twitter, Instagram, TikTok. Um, yeah, that's probably the best way you can contact me. You can also go ahead and email me. Um, but that's about it. That's all you gotta do, Pearl Muffin. You just gotta contact me. You win, congrats. Ha <laughs> ha! And next week's winner, remember, tell me, Moltres, Zapdos, Articuno. 
Which one is your favorite? But now, we have Hidden Fates and Shining Legends. Shining Legends and Hidden Fates. And how we're going to do this is, um, let's do one, uh, let's do like one, like Hidden Fates, Shining Legends, Hidden Fates, Shining Legends, Hidden Fates, Shining Le Hidden Fates. All right, so it's four packs of each. Both these are um, also skyrocketing in price, right? So I, I, where these are going to end up, I have no clue, guys. But Hidden Fates Elite Trainer Boxes were reprinted recently, and we we recently found out the power of Hidden Fates in sense of, like, people people really, really wanted Hidden Fates. Really badly wanted Hidden Fates. And is it, like... <laughs> the prices were were lovely. That's uh that's you know not an understatement Gra uh graveler giovanni's exile brock's grid eevee but hidden fates has a lot of cards that a lot of people really want ekins caterpie misty's water command and a snorlax non-holographic shining legends shining legends has gone through the roof i even made a video saying shining legends is uh underrated a couple weeks back and you know what i still I felt that at that time, right now, I think Shining Legends is definitely getting the love, love that it deserves. It's um, code card for you, code card for me, code fart for... I just said code fart. That's what I said, code fart. So, uh, the cards we're looking for, Shining Mew, Shining Rayquaza, or Mewtube. Um, so, let's find out what happens. But, uh, Shining Legends went from being, uh, I think, personally, very, very cheap. Totodile showing its little butt. Love it. Well, no, I don't love Totodile's butt. I'm just saying Totodile is showing its little butt. It's a cute looking card. I'm not saying anything about Totodile's butt, guys. Okay, so settle down. Let's calm. Let's bring it down a little. I'm very nervous right now. Weasel. Plusle. Mining. Touching butts. There we go. Toracat. Loving it. Scraggy is holding a stick. Totodile. Reverse hollow with its butt in the air. And a Reshiram, the same one that is going to be going along with the giveaway. We, we remember I said I pulled that card last week, but um, yeah, both these sets, uh, they're, they were they were the holiday sets for last year and the year before last year. So 20, not well, it's okay. It's the holiday set for 2019 and 2018. So they're not easy to get anymore. I mean, uh, Hidden Fates will show up in Walmarts and stuff like that. Shining Legends, good luck. You're paying a very high premium for Shining Legends at this point. And there is, uh, how can I say this? There ain't nothing you could do about it. There ain't nothing you could do about it. You gotta pay those premiums. I, I love opening these at week in, week out, guys. So I, I, put in the, I put in the money to get these packs for you guys. But what can I say? Is it, uh, is it expensive? Sure. But do I love doing it? Yeah, I do. Uh, Hidden Fates, I've been lucky enough to get mostly at retail. Shining Legends um, uh, is definitely a little more pricey now. That it, I feel bad that I didn't get more. And oh my god, let's go! Oh, I pulled this card already, but I will take another one. Oh, woo woo! Okay, okay, okay. I was not expecting that at all. There is nothing behind it. But Articuno. Articuno. I need to shall leave. I need to shall leave this card up real quickly. Wow. Wow. Man, what a what a dude, this is crazy. What a card. What a beautiful card. Let's check the back on this card. Uh, definitely off center, way off center. But look at that. That is off center for sure. But this is what you call a very, very nice pull. I will be taking it to the bank. Okay, cool. Shining Legends again. Shining Legends has yet to pull through. We got an Articuno. So I've pulled that Articuno card. I really want that Charizard, guys. What I would do for that Charizard. I really want that Charizard. Uh, Rayquaza from Shining Legends and Shining Mew are the ones that you really want from Shining Legends at the moment. I've pulled Genesect like a bajillion times, and I'm guaranteed I'm gonna I'm gonna pull Genesect again just because I know that's how my life works. 
Scrafty. That's a cool Scrafty card. It, it is it is ready to fight you. Ivysaur. I love that Ivysaur artwork. Torkoal. Bulbasaur is a beautiful artwork. Pikachu. Palkia. And a Verizian. Holographic. That is a card that I do not pull often from Shining Legends. That's for sure. That is for sure. I do not be pulling that card pretty often. So we're going to go ahead and move some of these off to the side. We're going to move these to the side real quickly. Bring in, bring in our big baby boy. Look at that. Look at that big baby boy. Look at that. Standing right next to its buddies and itself. But, yeah, so just tell me. I mean, that, that, that's fitting. We're giving away um, Moltres, Articuno, Zapdos, and we got Articuno. Uh, we, there isn't a full art of uh, Moltres or Zapdos in Hidden Fates. Uh, a shiny one but there was of articuno obviously you guys can tell it's on the freaking screen one two three four this is hidden face if i'm not mistaken i would love another shiny that would be amazing jinx charmeleon is it is it a sign is it a sign geodude pikachu clefairy Cubone, oh, shiny pseudo wudo, yeah, yes, yes, that is something I will take, I will take it, oh, woo, woo, I do not have shiny pseudo wudo yet, so that's a baby shiny, and, oh, okay, okay, I am definitely ruining some eardrums today. I am definitely ruining some eardrums today because that's a double pull. That's a Giovanni's Exile, which I may I want to add. Full art, full art trainer cards are going through the roof right now. Giovanni's Exile, it's just a matter of time. It's like a five, six dollar card right now. While I'm making this video, I promise you, in two weeks, come back, this is going to be like a thirty dollar card. For what reason? just the popularity that's what's happening to full art trainer cards right now full art trainer cards are just going through the roof let's go ahead and put both of these in a chalet we just packed the double the double bubbles of i i was not expecting two i was really not expecting two that's a really awesome that's a really awesome pull i would love the full art cynthia from this set the um we put these to the side real quickly. I would love full art Cynthia. I'm going to put this like that. We're going to put these like that. Like we're going to put this that like right there. Okay. Last pull up front. Let's put the last pull up front. All right. Let's go. We got a couple more packs left. Three more packs left. That's not bad. That's really good. That's a really solid. We're going good with Tin Tuesday. We're going good with Tin Tuesday, baby. I'm not questioning it. I am not questioning it. All right. Lightning Energy, Great Ball, Giant Truck Outside, Electrode, Lipard, Bweasel, Totodile, Toracat, Plusselminin, Touchin' Butt, Jinx, Reverse Hollow Lightning Energy, and a Zekrom. Okay, how fitting, how fitting, how fitting. It's not really fitting. I don't know why I keep saying how fitting. But it is what it is. Okay, cool. It doesn't matter. All right. Well, let's open up this final hidden pack. Hidden pack. Hidden pack. The final hidden pack. The final hidden fates pack of the day right here. Code card for you. Code card for me. Code card for everybody, dude. All right. Cool. Dark Energy. Metapod. Charmeleon. Magmar. Ekans. Eevee. Pikachu. Clefairy, Jigglypuff, Reverse Hollow, and a Brock's Training. Brock's Training. I know how you guys feel about last pack luck on Shining Legends. Shining Legends last pack luck. This is the final pack of today's Tin Tuesday. And we will be seeing if, 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 if we can pull... A Shining Legendary card. This is actually the first time I haven't gotten a good pull from Shining Legends. I've gotten holo- I mean, every pack is guaranteed a holographic, but I've yet to get a full art or um, half art or any sort of hit yet from Shining Legends. This is the first time. So will the last pack luck bless me today? Go Lurk, Pokemon Catcher, Incineroar, Litzen, 
Breloom, Voltorb, Golet, Bulbasaur, Mars Shadow, Reverse Hollow, and the final last pack of luck. Do we have last pack of luck? <gasps> Shining Genesis! <laughs> what did I say? What did I say? I can't get away from this card. I cannot get away from this card. Oh my god. Last pack of luck coming through again with the Shining Genesec. This is like somebody has to go back to my Tin Tuesdays and find out how many times I pulled this card. I think this may be my fifth, fourth or fifth time pulling Shining Genesec. At the least. At the least. We put this baby in a sleeve. We put this baby in a sleeve. Of course. Look at this. Look at these pulls. We got some good pulls today. We got some beautiful pulls today. We got some really beautiful pulls. The Articuno probably being the best one. But wow! Thank you so much for showing up to Tin Tuesday. My name's Powder. I'm the best booster machine. You guys know that. You guys know that. And you, you all, um, none of this could happen without you guys. So please do leave a like, comment below, and um, that's about it. Peace.